Oh, we in there. Let's go. Game one. Baraka with a stock. Let's go. Let's go, Baraka. But uh, as we all know, Plup is amazing at this video game. So we'll see uh, how he slowly dismantles uh, this matchup, this life. Uh, I'm joined here by the fake Bruno Mars. Do you have a Twitter, dude? Uh, Franco Centron. It's the wackest Twitter in the history of everything. Literally his name. But let's go. Okay. So, um, we saw Baraka trying to shut down with uh, up tilts, like, especially under platforms. Um, but Plup is just really good at the timing, like, shield oh, dropping out yeah. of it. His and, platform uh, movement is probably unparalleled at this point. Ooh. The fall off up air is so sick. Ooh. Oh my goodness. It's dirty. Oh, the awareness that, that it takes to, like, throw out those needles to interrupt uh, Baraka's recovery is, like, oh, yeah. crazy perception. Especially, like, the right height and stuff like yeah. that. Oh, he tried to do the um, slip past the up B and then re-grab ledge, but... Oh, oh Baraka, you don't want to see those. Yeah, that's what happens when you play good players. You just freak out. You get nervous. It happens. But Baraka's sick, so... Yeah, Baraka, he's not he's not afraid. Yeah. What do you think the counter pick is? Uh, ooh, seeing as how he's changing character... No, he's not changing characters, is he? That's why he lost, dude. That's why he lost Rumble. 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 Rumble I'm guessing dude. either FD or Yoshi's. Those are two, like... Oh, Pokemon. Jeez. Yeah. I don't know. It's just like, where do you want to yeah. take Sheik? He probably banned FD. He probably doesn't want to go to Yoshi's. Actually, F uh, Pokemon makes a lot more sense. I yeah. forgot Pokemon was even a stage. I didn't play it on it once today. Really quick uh, quick reaction with that spot dodge on the platform. Um, just knowing that Plup's going to throw the grab. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's just Plup's movement being so good or just Brock is misspacing some of these aerials, but uh, he definitely got shield grab on one of those fairs. And you those can... needles. Oof. Yeah, in this matchup, you don't necessarily ever have to get shield grabbed if your space is good, but Plup being as sneaky as he is, I bet yeah. he's probably just doing some movement tricks that makes Baraka unsure about the spacing. Ooh, spot on floors. And I like uh, the fact that Baraka, like, when he returns to neutral, he really starts to capitalize on, like, dash dancing, trying to use Mart's uh, advantages. Oh, yeah. His movement yeah. is, like, you have to abuse it in this matchup. Yeah. Like, Sheik has good platform movement because of her jump height, but, like, on the ground, Martha's, like, just superior. Yeah. Like, ooh, get her in the air. Let's go. Oh, she got a jump back? That sucks. Oh, yeah, he's going to transform back. Or is he going to fight with Zelda? He's probably going to... Oh, don't fight with Zelda, dude. That's not safe. He's going to up you back. Oh no, this, he's gonna get a free At this point, it's just, uh, no, he's, he's not. just feeling himself, dude. At this point, he's just feeling himself. Oh, he's been playing with me too, too much. I wonder why the needles didn't hit in that, uh, in that moment. Maybe the. It could be the hitbox of, like, the rock transformation being stupid, or. I mean, the hit, needles on the hitbox. Dumb. Or, wow, I said that backwards. Either way. 154%, like, just up tilt, yeah. Or up there? No, not yet. What he can do is first hit a side B into up B, which is like secret tech that no one knows. Oh, man. 
Let's see what he goes for. Because I think at this moment, like, yeah. it really shows your uh, colors as a you gotta get as a smasher. Side. Like, you, you, you're desperate. So he's throwing out the side B now. Yeah, there you go. Side B is probably like one of your better options, but you can't be too predictable with it because it is still punishable. Oh, uh, see. And it's crouch cancelable up to this percentage, which is pretty silly. But that's why you got to catch him when they're running. Oh no! Don't do both hits. I guess he's probably just expecting. trying to get him off stage. Yeah, he's probably expecting it to either link into something different. The side B hitbox is like where it sends you. It's so weird. Ooh, oh, forward air. That's nice. Ooh, ooh. Oh, he's Dude. feeling out the spacing. Oh, there you go. That's really good. good. Um, feel like this is like an indication of uh, player skill. Just the dash dancing around like Baraka was doing. Oh yeah. Um, just trying to like fish for uh, an opening. Really sick. Ooh, there you go. Toy. Super sneaky with those all the ASDI down into the yeah. slide off. That's like super next level against Marth. All you gotta do is hold down on the C stick and then left or right with the control stick. You'll crouch cancel it by ASDIing down. It's not a full like true crouch cancel, but you'll fall off the platform, slide off with zero lag, and you can counterattack. It's pretty nuts. I know some of those words. Like a few. Either way, Plup being, you know, probably one of the best in the world. That yeah. was all about that. Oh, with the re-grab from the Nair? It's just, you have to have, like, control of your character to know that that Nair is going to land. Like, it's going to lead into a, a re-grab. Like, oof, the awareness, dude. Oh, that down air was, like, kind of predictable, but I respect it. Because, like, I don't know, maybe he was expecting edge cancel. Oh, Ooh, my gosh. The counter. It works sometimes. Yeah, I think Baraka, he's no longer playing to win. I think he's playing to not get bodied. And that's when you know it's, like, it's over with this. Yeah, the follow up. He had his fist up already from the grab. He knew. That's rough. It's really rough. I mean, I don't know. Plup is the slayer of dreams here at this weekly.